soda friends as promised i am here with fago firework which is their bomb pop and i also got a real bomb pop not sure on the order to do this it's been a while since i've had a bomb pop i probably should have had one of those a while ago uh this guy has 20 ounces 300 calories I don't think, yeah, these are uh, no caffeine on these. Nothing too crazy in here. There's some potassium in here. Who knew? Um, but yeah, been excited to get this guy. I'm gonna go with this and then a bomb pop and then back to this. It's kind of hitting that, yeah. First, it's kind of a, I don't know, your first hit is, boy, this is a load of sugar. But then I, I almost feel like you get the uh, kind of a generic popsicle, the kind of uh, what I think is the white part of the popsicle. But then it totally finishes out in that cherry. Maybe some of the blue in there. Maybe some kind of a blue raspberry. But I'm definitely getting cherry at the end. All right, let's back to back these guys. Sorry for all the crinkling. Hold it away over here. Look at this measly little dude. These are the official bomb pops that I got from Kroger, but I feel like what I actually needed was the ice cream truck, like, knockoff. Because the red up here, I don't know, it's getting there. Mm. That bite where I got the red and the white is this thing. I'm going to hit here, see if I get some of that blue and see if that's... I'll do the whole thing. not super clear on what that blue is supposed to be but it almost comes across at least together with the white as cotton candy and i can see that as being the the front load of this and then the red finish definitely back to back throughout that bomb pop <clears throat> they nailed it this thing is on point. And I like that it's not just, here's all three of the flavors. I, I swear you get this in stages. How the hell do they do that? Yeah. You see this out here. Go get you some because if you're nostalgic for this flavor it is that all right guys hope you're having a fine sunday it's beautiful out here in atlanta it's nice and and chill not too hot not too cold sunny uh fine day for mother's day um <clears throat> this coming week uh i literally just got back from getting two of the new Circle K exclusive Purple Thunder Mountain Dew. Uh, my buddy Jeff hooked me up. Uh, and Jeff, who uh, 
is also a Mountain Dew live wire head. Me and him bonded years upon years upon years ago uh, because we both love Mountain Dew live wire and for whatever reason, Pepsi does not distribute Mountain Dew live wire within Atlanta. You can go to towns outside of Atlanta and sometimes find it and you can go to any state surrounding Georgia and find it. No other problem with any other Mountain Dew flavor, no other problem with Pepsi products. Specifically Livewire, specifically the orange one. Why can't we have nice things, Pepsi? Uh, anyways, Purple Thunder, I believe is being distributed in Atlanta, but I, I stopped at two Circle K's here and I, I couldn't find it. And Jeff uh, like randomly hit me up uh, that he was coming home from Savannah and, and was finding it with ease out there. So he grabbed me a couple bottles, which is pretty awesome. Uh, so I will get to that next week since it's super new. Keep an eye out at your Circle K's if you want. It's a, it's a berry and a plum. Mountain Dew. And uh, who knows what I'll get into next week. I still got all those AL8s. I got some Jones. I got some, some randoms. Uh, yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna, we'll make our way through it. Like I said, hope you're having a fine Sunday and, uh, enjoy the rest of the day and I'll see you next week. All right.